Hey everyone, how's it going? In today's video, I'm going to show you how to draw a Parasaurolophus from Jurassic World Dominion. Now, I might have butchered that name. I know it took me several takes to get it right when I was drawing it, but even if it's wrong, I just hope you guys enjoy this drawing, and if you have any other dinosaur ideas, definitely let me know, and I'd be happy to draw them. So thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoy. Now, start off with our Parasaurolophus from Jurassic World Dominion. We're going to begin with the eye. So let's begin right here, and usually our dinosaur eyes are a little mean looking. This one's going to be a little nicer. So let's begin with a little line that kind of curves up and down, and then one that's going to go down and then up. And we'll just color most of this in, leaving just a little bit white. I'll make a little line that goes above it and a little line below it. We'll make a little line that kind of goes up and then in. I'm going to bring this line down to here. Next we're going to come out and we're going to bring it up and over. Then right here we're going to draw a line that's going to go out and it's going to curve around. Starting here, this line is going to curve back. We're going to put a little bump at the end here of their little horn. We're going to bring it down and then curve in a little bit. Starting here, we're going to bring this line over and then bring it up. And then right here, we're going to bring this line down. Put a little black dot here with a little line around it. I'm going to add a couple little curved lines right here. And then starting here we're going to draw a little line that's going to come down for the back of the neck. Right here we'll go down and in. And then another one here, we're going to go down and in for the chest. Right here, we're going to come down. Then we're going to go down and just kind of bring this line down a little bit. Bring a little line up, and then we're going to bring another one that goes down and up to here. Bring a little line that's going to go over and curve it up for an arm. Bring this line over. Next, we're going to begin with the leg. So to start with the leg, we're going to begin up here. We're going to make a line that's going to come down at an angle, and then we're just going to bring it back like this. Next, we want to come down. Now we're going to go out here and bring it back. Do that same thing here. We're going to bring it out and come back. Now for the back of the leg, let's bring this up, and we'll add just a little bit of a hook onto it. I'm going to bring this in, and we'll add a nice big curve up here. I want to come back up here and kind of finish off the back. So we're going to bring this line up, and we're going to come down, and you see it's a little bit bumpy here. I'll bring this line down here, make it come to a point, and then we're we will bring it right back up here. Starting here, let's add that other leg. We'll kind of go down and then in, bring it out here at an angle, bring it down and back, 
and another one go down and bring it back here. Next we'll bring this up and in. Starting here, we'll draw this line down. Make a line that comes down and up. And one more that's going to come down and up. And we'll do one here and bring it up. And a line here. Now here's our basic shape. Now let's come in here and add some different details. So I'm going to add a little kind of broken line over here and another kind of long broken line or two along the horn. We'll add a couple little broken lines over here and a little line here. I like to add a couple little extra lines kind of right around some of these little areas on the legs to show some wrinkles. And even a few little lines here on like the knee spot. Some little broken lines right along the tail. And some little lines kind of along the back of the neck. These little broken lines just add some detail. So we'll put some over here on the arm and a couple right along the body as well. We'll add some little curved lines, kind of where the toes are going to be. And some little lines right down the tail. We'll add a couple more little lines here. I'm going to add some little lines right along the mouth here just kind of showed this is like a little like duck bill kind of creature and a few more right along the face. I'll also add some little claws onto here on the fingers. And just a couple little extra lines kind of right along the face. And there is your drawing of a Parasaurolophus from Jurassic World Dominion. I'm going to fast forward and start coloring this. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed.